This morning finds us at the Garden of the Morning Calm in Korea. We're out of Seoul today. Uh, we're on a tour with Tracy. Uh, we're about to visit this garden and then go to Nami Island. Uh, this garden here is the oldest private garden in South Korea and it was built to show the calmness of the place. say about our stay in Korea is that altogether it's so green around this place and there's so many mountains. Um, what I'm really impressed with is in a lot of the cities you actually see them build the city around the hills and apartments. Um, that's great. I love the nature here. It's really good in this garden. is this fantastic. yourself a garden cottage here based on a model of an English garden. Um, I reckon this house is modelled on something you'd find at the Cotswolds. Uh, so yeah, it's a typical English garden here in South Korea. So this Korean garden exhibits traditional Korean landscaping. Um, you often see the ponds all over the place with their bridges, lily pads and buildings in the middle of them. This island symbolises an utopia between the bridge and the water. trees are famous of because they live a very long time and they're very popular in uh, Asian culture. Okay so after walking around the Garden of the Morning Calm for about an hour and a half it's time for us to depart to Nami Island in a second but I just want to stress how amazing these gardens are. Uh, those have done a lot of work over the 20 years that they've been doing it it's well worth a visit if you're at Seoul, it's uh, spectacular, I would like to have spent more than the uh, allotted time we had here, but that's life. 